Hi, I'm Jay. And this is... Patches. And this is... Ben. And we're here at Schoolie Swarm 2022. 2022. And today, me and Patches and Ben are going to ride around this whole beautiful property here in Melrose, Florida and show you what this place is all about. So come along for the ride of your life. We're going in a hole, hang on. Okay. That's okay, we're in a hole. It's okay, it's okay. <laughs> okay, that was a lot quicker than I thought it was. We are cooking up some bird's eye. Looks pretty good so far. Should be a few minutes before this is really good. We gotta just drag her up the hill. We'll worry about chains later. We call this the CTC, which stands for Cargo Trailer Conversion, or Cargo Trailer co Camper, or Cargo Trailer Crap, whatever you want to call it. It has all kinds of names. In case you're wondering what four-week-old poop looks like after it's been chemically treated, and there's your answer. A month to 17 children, I would have thought you might have had like 30 of those cards. Oh, I, this is just for two days? Hey everyone, welcome to Schoolie Swarm 2022 from Tiny Wineland. I'm your host Jay and this is Patches on the back. Say hi Patches. Patches. And there's Ben on the bike. Hey Ben. Alright, we're going to go check this place out. Let's do it. the epitome of non-electric noise right now. <laughs> this is where everyone came in and checked in. They lined the buses up, took their photos, uh, found out how long they're going to be here for, and then uh, showed us a schedule. There was a check-in sign, some tree house over there. I mean, oh, that might be the zip line. Oh, that is the zip line. Yep. Wow, it is tiny. And then we had to come through these woods. Hopefully we all made it. If you want to come to Schoolie Swarm in Melrose, Florida, Hey! You gotta, um, we'll probably lose him. He'll catch we up to us. Back. He'll catch up to us. Um, no, he's still here. <laughs> um, you wanna make sure if you have a bus, you be very careful down here because it's soft sand and you can get stuck real easily. We'll talk to Zach about that later, but right now we're gonna go on a tour around this whole entire property and see just what's going on in the magical world of schoolies. Now, as you all know, I live in a tiny home cargo trailer conversion. But these people have embraced me and they're very friendly and sociable. Um, one thing we all share, well, there's an RV, Renegade RV, kid. Yeah. What's, up, buddy? What's up, man? One thing we all share, a common bond in this property is that we all believe that there's a greater purpose to our life on this earth than the nine to five grind, suffering through the bills and just basically getting choked out. And uh, everyone may have a different walk, they may have a different path, but one thing you're gonna understand when you go through here is that we all share the common bond of being human beings on this earth. Black, white, red, yellow, gay, lesbian, straight, you name it. Everyone is the same here. And people need to realize that. And what society has failed to realize, hold on, what society has failed to realize is that this is how life should be for every single person on this earth. This is where me and Patches dumped earlier, but we're not gonna do it this time. We're not doing it, we're not, we're not, we made it, woo! Yeah, yeah. And you just gotta take in life as it comes and just remember that there is so much more to this life than, a, than one paycheck and a mortgage. These people have traded security for freedom. And for some people, they found a way to actually do both at the same time. And that is an impressive feat for anyone in this world. That if you can actually be secure and free at the same time, then my hat goes out to you a thousand times over. 
because it is not an easy task. These people had families, they had homes, they had uh, they had jobs, they had all kinds of stuff. And whether it be by like necessity or for love of the open road or just unbelievable, absolute desire to to be something more than they were. They all joined a common bond to come out here and it's just a great adventure. And we are taking you guys through it all right now. We'll be right back. Let's <laughs> stop with that. That's Ben's mom, Stacy. <laughs> She's kind of a mother hen, but she loves her son and he is an amazing kid. But me and Patches, our moms aren't here, so we're gonna keep riding for a minute. Ben will keep up to us. This is, um, I think this is Old Field Pond is where we are here. And this is where the, it's a Boy Scout camp. And we're basically gonna go down to the river lake now and see the people on the lake. You got Ben back? He won't, he will not stay down for long. Just a beautiful view down here on a Sunday morning in February. It was a little cold last night. A little cold actually being very nice, but. Buses come through here and they might as well be swimming because this is really bad. It's dried out pretty good actually. That's where's Tiki. She has a cool dog named Rio. Tiki! <laughs> Not in home. What's up, brother? Dogs, cats, men, women, children, every walk of life out here. Yes, every walk of life, all ages. There's no discrimination whatsoever out here. There's Jay and Gordon. Jay and Gordon from the homestead. And we are just like, just cruising around, checking it all out. This property is bordered by private property. So you gotta take respect for the landowners around here. And just remember, you can't go everywhere. But for the most part, it's pretty wide open. We've seen people brushing their teeth, walking their dogs, walking around in their pajamas, just doing everything they possibly can to have a good time. And while we're only here for nine days, that's nine days here together. That's not nine days in life. These people, <laughs> second time we got him. These people have made a conscious decision and they stand by it, good or bad. And I am absolutely blessed to have known all these people. And while I probably not get all their names or know their numbers, it was a pleasure to share the space with them. So we're just gonna chill for a minute and just gonna drive through here without any more commentary and I'll let you guys enjoy the view. Okay, looks like Patch is gonna take over for me. A little at a time. <laughs> little at a time. Yep. We I don't remember going through. We went through there last time. We went through, we're going to go this way. So. We get through here, I think we can. Yeah, we can. Oh, yeah, we can make it through here. Oh, yeah. Whoa. Uh, it comes down. Please. Hold on. You're good. We just conked out, boys and girls. No, she just, she just died. Yeah, edit, edit. <laughs> I have no clue. Don't ask. Ask the Chinese. They made it. <laughs> Casey Newman. Hey, there's Casey. That's Lynn. Oh yeah. Yeah. So we'll go up that way. On the side. Yeah. We can. Okay. I see. What We haven't even seen the bulk of the schoolies. We're still just in the periphery of what this place is. We're gonna get into the heart of it. Everyone kind of landed in the middle, it looks like. This is the outskirts. This is the friggin' outskirts of the outskirts. Oh, we're gonna go by that one right there, ready? We gotta check this one out, guys. We gotta check this one out. Look at this, dude. Love, love it, love it, love it. In fact, guys, that's good for a second pass. <laughs> here we go, boys. Yeah, we're turning around right here. So the next time you see a school bus on the road, guys, just with a bunch of kids in it, realize they have a life after this, and this is it. 
There she is. Check it out! Oh, oh. Love it. Hell yeah. All right, buddy. We're on the back side of what they call the family area right now, guys. We're gonna cut through the woods here to come out on the main peripheral. Doing a little bit of wood hogging in here. That's what this bike was made for. There's this cool bus, remember? The one you like, Cass, is right there. Look, we even got RVs here, guys. Look at this bus. Check this bus out. No, no. But people don't know that, Hatches. I come from the tiny home community, and they believe that the divide between schoolers and tiny homes is huge. And I'm hoping that with these videos, we can change that. Yeah, we'll go around there and around there and back around there. Yeah. There's Melody. This is kind of the heart of it over here, guys. Everyone's kind of gathered over here. We've got other clusters, though. We'll take you to them. There's Jonathan. He Jonathan. does solar. Jonathan does solar. But I'm not supposed to tell Jonathan that. <laughs> I'm not supposed to tell anyone that, I mean. Friends, yep, to the kids. Oh, they're everywhere, dude, everywhere. It's like a massive. Look at that, he's got a freaking X Cargo on top of his freaking truck. That's awesome. Look at this, a van. Look, they put these up so the buses wouldn't get stuck. <laughs> We won't have that problem. <laughs> Our biggest risk is falling down from the sand. Green bus got right through this part. Oh, they plow right through here. That made it through. Oh, no, no, he, that got stuck in there. Yeah. We'll go this side and go this side, the rest side and around. Yep. Fun. We're having fun here. Okay. Yeah. yeah. No, it's fun. Hi, I'm Jay. And this is Badges. And this is Ben. And we're here at Sully Swarm. Point to point 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 no, it's not bad. It was the balls. <laughs> like the ball, dude. Okay, we're gonna try to go between the flag here. Like that. I'm good. I'm good. Okay. 